Jessica, there were a couple of issues here this morning. That small fire on the underside of the train and a broken pipe inside the station here. Service is back to normal at this point, but the general manager of the T was here this morning to see the problems firsthand. The main thing is no one was injured. Um, the workforce responded. We're taking care of that situation. MBTA General Manager Phil Ng at the Charles MGH stop on the red line. A fire underneath a train going over the Longfellow brought service to a stop here around 545 this morning. It appears uh, a condition with our AC condenser. Um, that was uh, immediately rectified. Everybody was safely discharged at the stations. Boston Fire says they tried to hook up to a pipe inside the station. There was a, a piece of that pipe that when we filled it with water, it kind of came apart. And so as you could see, the water started filling the first floor of the station. We brought a hose over at like the base of the, the Longfellow and we also brought water cans up, just like basically like cans of water that we, we uh, manually carry up and we were able to extinguish it that way. It's plan, it's plan B. Crews cleared water out of the station. Shuttle buses replaced train service between Harvard and Broadway until 8 a.m. But delays lasted well into the morning commute. It's been really bad, actually. Um, all the trains are coming like every 30 minutes or so. We have work to do, though, obviously. And, and I want folks to know that we are, we are going to be persistent and determined. Um, and they will see a system that they, they can be proud of. As for that broken pipe, the general manager of the T says it had been inspected within the past five years and passed. The T is now looking into that small fire and also the issue with the pipe here. We're live in Boston. Jennifer Egan, WCVB News Center.